hey hi friends welcome back to the our channel in this video i will just show you this how you make your own accident prevents alerting system here i use this adxl 335 sensor and when each sensor detect any accident then is sending this proper gsm call and is sending this proper gps location with latitude and longitude now in this video i will explain you how you design your own gps tracker device step by step please continue watching this video i will explain all the things in details first if you not subscribe my youtube channel then please subscribe it and hit this bell icon to get notification first i will publish this more than 200 video in my youtube channel and i will publish this article related to this project in our website www.justelectronics.com now see this component which component i use in this project First, I use this Arduino Nano microcontroller board. Neo 6M GPS module. Sim 800L GSM module. LM2596 step down converter. 16 by 2 LCD display with I2C module. ADXL335 sensor. See here I use this Arduino Nano microcontroller board, Neo 6M GPS module. I will connect it to this VCC is 5 volt TX and RX will be connected to this RX and TX pin and the ground will be connected to this ground. Like that, SIM 800L GSM module I used and this TX will be connected to this pin number 2 and RX will be connected to pin number 3. VCC will be connected to this 3.7 volt to 4 volt and the ground will be ground. ADXL sensor I used and this one is the connected to this analog pin A0, A1, A2 and the one small piezo buzzer I use and they will be connected to pin number 13. Two push button I use and they will be connected to pin number 10 and 11. Now the circuit diagram will be completed. Let, okay, let's make this hardware. Now I will put all these component slots in zero PCB. And I soldering in this back side like I just given this Arduino Nano slots, new 6M GPS slots, GSM slot and in back side I soldering all this connection in jumper wires through now i put this component one by one first i put this arduino nano microcontroller board then i put this new 6m gps model Then I attach this SIM 800L GSM module. Then I attach this ADXL335 sensor. And I attach in this slot. This 16x2 LCD is optional part. If you want, then you attach it. Otherwise, you just ignore it. Now I attach in this given this slots. And here is this small car. And I use this double side tape. And then I attach this ADXL335 sensor in front of this car. Now the hardware will be completed. See this code. First, we install this few library like Liquid Crystal I2C dot H library, uh, Tiny GPS plus plus dot H library, and Math dot H library. You require to this first add a library. Just you copy and go to this library section and paste it. Just remove this dot H and you add install this proper library. Proper library. I already installed it that's why I just display this remove button 
like that you install all this library step by step <laughs> like that you install all this library one by one like tiny uh, tiny gps plus plus dot h now the library will be completed then you define the uh, lcd pins here uh, you just put your mobile number and then you defining this uh, where you connected to this gsa module in this board i connected this pin number 2 and 3 and then defining this rx and tx pins of gps module and i connect to this buzzer in pin number 13 and button will be connected to pin number 11 and this one is the adxl 335 sensor connection i use this a0 a1 and a2 pins now this one is the or integer and boolean function this one is the wired setup here i just defining this input and output devices See, I just defining this sensitive is the 46. If you want to more sensitive, then you change it according to you. Now, this one is the wired setup, and here I just defining this input and output devices and declare all these installation function to GSM module. And this one is the wired loop function. See, when the micro will detect any impact to this ADA XL 335 sensor then is going to this proper loop function and do this gsm calling and sending this text message with particular mobile number if the impact will be detected and after the few seconds is not any push button will be pressed then is buzzer is the beeping otherwise is this slow and this one is the gps location when this direct uh, impact will be more than threshold value then sending this proper gps location with simple text message and after this text message will be sending is sending this call go to this tool select this proper board select this proper port and hit this uploading button now the code will be completed to this uploading now see this working of this project first we turn on this system and we hit this adxl 335 sensor and when it's crossed to this threshold value the gsm calling to this particular mobile number and after the calling is sending this proper gps location with text message through now we just wait for this calling after the few seconds the calling will be come you change your mobile number according to you in this code and the code link available in this video description if you want then please check out see the calling will be come and after the few seconds the text sms also will be come with accident alert message through and when you open this message so that this proper latitude and longitude latitude and longitude now we attach this lcd display and we hit this adxl sensor the lcd will be display crash detected and magnitude is the 46 i mean is it cross to this threshold value then is sending this proper gps calling proper gsm calling and is sending this proper gps location with text message through I hope you like this video and if you like it please hit the like button share with all the friends if you new in my youtube channel please subscribe and hit this bell icon to get notification first thanks for watching have a nice day